does this work? All right, so here we got some Asian pancakes. You can help me build one of these. Okay. You can find picking duck um, at an Asian market. You can find duck at a regular grocery store. Grab some of this, yeah, Queen. Yeah, for Let's sure. Get the meat laid in. This is the traditional way of making it. You got your pancake, you mm -hmm. got your duck. Then you throw on some spring onion. Don't for worry, a little bit of I just crunch. I wash my hands. I know you. I know you like. Why is she just going in that duck? Because I washed my hands when you were a lugger. Oh yeah. <laughs> and even if you don't wash your hands, you know it adds a little bit of that flavor to it, right? It like, makes it more rich. Here we got. Here we got some sliced cucumber, mm -hmm. and that'll give it a great texture. And then of course we just put on some delicious oh, hoisin yeah. sauce. Mm -hmm. Not too much. Not too little. Just the right amount. Gives it that sweetness. Oh yeah, a little bit of sweetness, a little bit of tang. And this is just so delicious. So let's cheers with this traditional <laughs> pancake oh, yeah. version. Buon appetito. <laughs> Bing. Mm. <laughs> How good is that? Isn't that delicious with that the is duck delicious. and the sauce? You're making me be bad in here. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Next up, we've got the Tex-Mex version. So here I've got a corn tortilla, mm -hmm. and we're gonna make a delicious pomegranate avocado. So mashed up um, uh, avocado, throw in some lime juice, some chilies there for heat, a little bit of garlic. Queen, if you want to help me, yeah, we've sure, got some chopped a, cilantro a over idea. there. A little bit of cumin, okay? I'm gonna throw in some paprika. All these delicious flavors. Oh, yeah. Here we got cherry tomatoes, nice and ripe, but only the skin. You don't want to use the seeds, it's too much either. Here we got onion. Look how colorful that's And too. then, oh yeah, beautiful colors. And then the key is pomegranate seeds. Oh wow, and so that's there the you fun go. of it. Kind of mm -hmm. doing it your way. That's the way you gotta do it. So now we're gonna build these. I'm gonna I know grab... I probably wasn't supposed to mush it like this. Oh no, this is perfect. This is exactly she how you're supposed to do it. <laughs> She always hooks it up, so I never have to do this. Oh, you can't mess up with avocado. It's already messed up as it is. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much. So, a little bit of our delicious uh, guacamole here. And just put that on right there. And here, I've got some cheese. How good is that? That's good. A little bit Impressive of cheese. Texture. And we're gonna drizzle that with some pomegranate balsamic reduction. Oh wow, that's okay? gonna hit it off. Oh, this is nice and thick. So it's wow. kind of like a hoisin sauce, but less hoisiny. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah. Are you gonna take a bite of this, Queen? You know how much weight am I gonna gain <laughs> in this segment alone? <laughs> Grab that side. There you go. Mmm. Yum eat. How's that? That good? I've never tasted anything like that. <laughs> Hopefully that's a good thing. No, 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 <laughs> it's different. Because I got the paprika and I, I, I'm getting a little heat from it. Mm-hmm. And the freshness of the, of the pomegranate. And yeah. of course the duck. Yeah, yeah, it's got a lot of different flavors going on. I can't walk through Chinatown without stopping. I mean, I go to New York, I have to walk to Chinatown. I look in the window and pick a duck and we go for it. Well, you know, they just look so gorgeous there, hanging with the crispy skin. Like, mm. Mm. So now time for Italian style. This is too easy. We're gonna make a spicy Italian salsa in a food processor. You throw in a bunch of cherry tomatoes. You get some fresh red onion in there, some basil, okay? Here we've got some parsley, just like that. Garlic, my God, we're filling this thing up, huh? <laughs> I'm, I'm just waiting get to see down how there, you're get down do this. there. <laughs> this okay. is gonna be exciting. <laughs> Here, a little bit of oregano. It's very what? Exciting. I know. Yeah. <laughs> the girls I know. Are like Will this. it fit? Will it not? <laughs> Can't wait. A Thai chili <laughs> and some good quality extra virgin olive oil, just like that, and some balsamic vinegar for tang. She's mm -hmm. getting it in there for tang. And guess what? <laughs> I'm not gonna close that thing because we have some already ready. Oh, I was about to say, oh, oh, no, I was gonna accept you all. You are you stressing. Wanted to see it. I wasn't stressing. I'm like, I this thing could be like, I wanted to see it go. <laughs> all right, so here we have the finished salsa. Okay, we're gonna put some duck, some gorgeous duck on a garlic roasted baguette. Okay, get that nice garlic flavor. Little bit of our salsa here, just like that. And we're gonna top it off with some Parmigiana shavings. 
I just pulled the Jada de Laurentiis there. Parmigiano. You got that parmigiano. I just love to hear you speak. <laughs> Wish me luck, kids. <laughs> this is part. You want some? Picking duck you Italiano. Have some of this. Yeah, yeah dig in, ladies. I'm waiting. Dig in. Mmm. Mmm. Prognosis. Yeah. 